What's going on Omnibuddies? Mitch here and today we have another unboxing for you. And it's big. All right, so this box right here, it's a big one. Comes from us, from comes to us from none other than uh, this channel sponsor, Organic Price Books. Uh, if you are looking for any kind of collected edition comic, Organic Price Books, at least in the U.S., is going to be your best bet. Uh, they ship fast. They pack super well. Their prices are pretty much competitive anywhere on the market that you're gonna find, anywhere online, any comic book store. They're gonna probably be the best price, if not very close to it. And you get affiliate points. Uh, as you buy stuff, you can use the Omnibuddy code for two bucks off every order until you stock up a whole bunch of affiliate points um, for just spending money there. And then you can cash those out and use those at the store to get free books. So it works out for everyone. So make sure to use that Omnibuddy code for two bucks off every order. And then once you stock up enough points at Organic Price Books, use your points for free books. It works out. It's awesome. Anyways, let's dive in to this box. I am very excited. I cut it open pretty quick. We're going to open this thing up. Let's see. Bring it over a little bit. Ah. And of course, great thing with OPB is, hey, attention, postal inspector. These qualify for media mail because they do. And sometimes they try not to say it's media mail and qualify because it's comics, but it qualifies and that explains it. So we got some protective cardboard on the top. Love this. One, my kids love coloring on it. Two, if they don't get to it first and I sell some books or ship some stuff, Christmas is coming up, holidays are coming up. A lot of these boxes go to that, so love it. My wife doesn't appreciate the boxes until it's Christmas time and then she loves how, much, how many boxes I keep. So, there we go. Oh yeah, we've got some great packing in here. Oh, we've got a box within a box. So we're gonna set this up here. And I have my kid scissors because we cannot for the life of us find our grown up, adult, whatever, big scissors. Um, so make sure to use that Omnibuddy code so that I can afford to buy new scissors because apparently I gotta buy new scissors. Should be cutting away from myself. So do as I say, not as I do, because you don't want to end up cutting yourself. All right, let's dig into the first box. I'm going to be sweating by the end of this. This is the most exercise I get throughout the week. All right, I can see what we got now. Look at all this bubble. Your books cannot be damaged. It's insane. Thank you, JP. All right, we got the first two books here. One I am very excited about, Berserk Deluxe Edition, Volume 8. This series is amazing. Uh, it's so sad that uh, Kentaro Miura, Miura uh, passed away a few months ago. Super sad to hear about that. Um, but what's the best way we can let his legacy live on? Read his comics, buy his stuff, help his family out, do all that. Um, and Dark Horse is just killing it with these deluxe editions. So amazing. Uh, but the story is even more amazing. So cannot wait. I've been stocking up a couple of these so I can marathon through them because it's manga. So it reads super fast. And uh, you want to be able to keep going when you're reading this story. So it's got that little insert in there. Pretty awesome. Definitely needs that parental advisory sticker. That is for sure. Um, we have more manga. We have Blade of the Immortal, Volume 3. I haven't read Volume 2 yet. I really need to. Uh, loved Volume 1. Super cool. So I'm kind of doing the same thing because you read through this super fast. You want to be able to jump onto the next thing right away. So now we got 
volume three of Blade of the Mortal. And here is a book I've been super excited about. More Hellboy. Absolutely love Hellboy. And Mike Mignola is just killing it in that Mignola verse with young Hellboy. He's got Witchfinder. He's got uh, Baltimore and then BPRD, Abe Sapien, all these different things going on. And it is just so awesome. Cannot wait to read uh, this edition. It's classic Hellboy stuff, but it is young Hellboy. So super, super excited to finally dig into that. Let's get rid of some even more. Oh my gosh. Falling all over my cords. I have a huge pile of paper now on the floor. No one can say JP and OPB do not pack well because they are, in my opinion, actually, I don't even think it's my opinion. It's basically a fact at this point with comic book stores, they are the gold standard. Uh, we have another box in here and there's even some paper on the bottom, if you can see that. So there's a ton in there. Let's get box number two within the first box open and see what we have in here. I try and pre-open all these um, so you're not watching me cut stuff open but uh, when he boxes boxes within boxes kind of hard to pre-open everything. So Let's see what we got here. More bubble, more books. I'm seeing something, very excited about it. We have Something is Killing the Children, Deluxe Slipcase Edition. I am going to be jumping into this series ASAP. I'm gonna be doing a read through of this starting tomorrow night and finishing up my Spooktober overview event where I review and talk about all the spooky, scary, horror, whatever related books uh, throughout the month of October. This is going to be the last one. I'm going to read it tomorrow so I can get it done by October 31st and get it out as the last and final overview. So excited about this. Um, if you don't know, Boom uh, did the final order cutoff a month before they the book came out so they weren't able to print near enough copies of everything ordered um, but the deluxe edition inside the slipcase is exactly the same as just the regular deluxe edition that you can order on organic price books and starting january 2022 they're going back to print or pre-order for a uh, second print of the slip case. Uh, we'll see what it looks like. I'm guessing it's going to be red foil on the front, which will actually look even cooler. And then that comes out in, I think, June 2022. So if you miss the slip case, absolutely have to have the slip case. You can wait till then. Um, otherwise, just get the deluxe edition. But again, that's all up for pre order and order on organic price books. And now let's get into what I think. Yep, the final book even more bubble wrap and paper in that box, like insane amounts of protection. And I am very, very excited about this book. Uh, in an absolute format box, here it is. The American Gods slipcase, complete American Gods slipcase edition. So stoked to read this. Um, Oh, Neil Gaiman is amazing, and I've heard nothing but great things about this. I haven't let myself watch the uh, the series, the movie or TV show series on American Gods because I need to read this first before I can let my watch myself watch the show. That's just how I am, and I will be doing an overview of this most definitely. Cannot wait! It's got that faux leather, that gold. Uh, foil stamping and it's got the gold foil pages, uh, page edges. Um, looks like an old school Bible that you'd find like on your grandma's uh, uh, coffee table or something like that. Um, so 
it's awesome and it is a beautiful addition so i'll be doing an overview of that too so recap we got american gods we've got a little bit of juxtaposition something that's killing the, killing the children go back to religion we got hellboy young hellboy and then we got some manga blade of the immortal volume three and then we have berserk volume eight and that wraps it up right there pretty awesome haul super excited it took forever jp ships super fast but when it gets into this was ups uh once it gets into ups fedex or uh usps's hands it's all up into the uh mail service god's hands and mine sat in austin texas for nearly a week before ups was like oh we should probably ship that out so they finally did and then it was moving super fast but those distribution centers kill me anyways that's it for today uh, hope you enjoyed this haul hope you're excited about some of the reviews coming up make sure to like subscribe hit the bell for notifications do all those things but most importantly thing i always say comment what are you reading what are you hauling what are you getting in did you get new gods any manga uh hellboy something that's killing the children what do you think of that whole fiasco talk to me comment hit me up all right that's it for today take care stay safe